So as you can see over here, I got a bunch of data. So I got the name and skill listed in one column over here and the level of uh, their skill over here. But what I want is I do not want the uh, skill uh, in the same column like this uh, along with the name. So I do want to have them in a separate column. So for that, what I'm going to do is I'm simply going to insert column over here. So I'm simply going to select these three columns and right click and insert so that uh, I can actually copy the data over there quite easily. So for this, I'm going to use the text to column feature, which is located along uh, in the data section right here. So I'm going to select this column over here and then I'm going to select text to columns. So I'm going to select this and you can see that I can have a fixed width if I want to work with the width. In my case, I want to separate these out right there. So let's say I want to separate everything out after the comma. So I'm going to uh, select delimited because I want to separate, uh, separate the data out of the special character. I'm gonna press next and I'm going to select comma right here. So no tabs, I just wanna separate using comma. And now you can see that I have a preview right here. So I got the names and here, uh, everything after the comma, it is, separate, it is separating it into a different column. So I'm going to press next. As you can see, I can have general over here because I do not want anything right here. So this is a general text, as you can see. Uh, and I'm simply going to press finish right here. And you can see that the columns have been split. And even this one, I want to split it into first name and last name. So I'm going to select this again, and then I'm going to use text to column over here, and then gonna go to next. So in this case, I'm going to use a space and others as well. I can also uh, use my own uh, set of, I can also use um, uh, any set of uh, special character over here. But in space, you can see that this is being um, split as well. We're going to fix that later on. So I'm going to uh, just select space, press next and finish. So I'm going to just press yes. Uh, it seems to have replaced the skill over here, which is something I don't want. So I'm just going to select this. I'm going to cut this out and put it over here so that it does not replace the data. So I'm going to go over here and then do text to column, press next space and finish and you can see that now everything had been has been divided so i'm just going to delete this cell right here this is my first name this is my last name and this is my skill all right so that is how you can reorder all the data in a in a table inside of Microsoft Excel, even if you have pre-formatted it. So this does not work if they are in different formats. Let's say you have your last name um, or first name or the skill in a different order, but it, as long as you have them in the same order, it is easier to divide them into different columns. So I hope you guys learned something as always, and as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.